Darren Barefoot of Old Dominion. Well, you have a year under your belt uh, there with the Monarchs of Old Dominion. Uh, what are your goals and expectations as you go into year number two? Well, very excited because we have eight returners and six newcomers. So this year is kind of going to be a special year for us because we're not eligible to compete in the CAA tournament. Every game matters to us. Every game we treat is like a conference championship tournament. And so in practice, we're getting after it. Every rebound, every loose balls. We keep saying we're going to lead the nation in high fives and floor burns. So we're going to be scrappy. Jackie Cook earned a spot in the starting lineup for Old Dominion and is the team's returning leading scorer after averaging 10 points per game. Talk about what you need her to do to fill the shoes of graduated Tia Lewis and expand her leadership role. Well, you know, it's always hard to replace someone like Tia. Um, who just left actually yesterday to go to Israel to play professional. But you know, one thing about Jackie is she's a great leader. And what I want her to do is, you know, we're going to have a solid team this year. We have a lot of players that can score. We got players that can defend. We have depth. So for her, I just want her to be really positive and teach others. And that's why, you know, right now in practice has been really good because it's become contagious. Everybody, all the returners are teaching the newcomers. So we're moving along quickly. Ashley Betts White had a stellar rookie year, averaging eight points and three and a half re uh, assists per game, that is, for the Lady Monarchs. Uh, were you surprised at the impact she had as a freshman, and what is the next step in her development? You know, she is so tough. You know, at the beginning, you know, I knew that she had to take on a big load. We really didn't have a backup point guard. You know, we didn't have depth. But she showed me a lot of character. She, show she showed me a lot of grit. And so, you know, as the season went on, she got better. And what we want her this year to do is take care of the ball make good decisions. And one thing about Ashley is that when she spots up, she can shoot the ball really well. So for us, we might, you might see her at the two guard too because she can add that extra you know, element in her game. Uh, Lady Monarchs do welcome six newcomers uh, to the team this year. Talk about uh, some of the players who you expect to make a major impact early this season. Well, first of all, this team is, is uh, just an unselfish team. And when you look at the six newcomers, you start at the top with Shea Kelly. She was Miss Colorado. She was an All-American coming from Northwest Junior College. She comes in and she brings us a lot of experience. She will be a special player in the CAA. She can pretty much do it all. So she can play inside, she can play outside. Um, she can finish with her right hand, her left hand. So she really does bring us a lot to the table. And then when you look at Stephanie Garner, who was a transfer from Miami last year who sat out for us, she watched on the sideline. And what no one knows about her, she was tough in practice. You know, when they got down on themselves in, in games last year, she was picking them up. And so we really like the way that she can really lead with her maturity. She actually helped Miami to their first ACC championship. So we're looking for her experience and helping others grow and develop. And then we've got some true freshmen that we're excited about and that are going to really contribute right away. Half the CA teams advanced to the postseason last year. How challenging is it uh, to, become, to continue to compete in this league? And is the CAA's reputation growing nationally? It's exciting. You know, this is what you live for, you know, and I'm so glad that the CA has really grown. And, you know, to me, it's, it's a good balance in the CA, whether you have a lot of experience. Um, you have some good trans solid transfers and so you know evaluating that last year I knew that we had to get some experience but for us you know every game of CA you can't take off that's what's so special about the league you know and everybody loves every team that competes hard every night and that's the CA I think across the board there's a lot of great players and there's excellent coaches it's gonna be a fun year Karen Barefoot of Old Dominion thanks